Hey guys, welcome back. Sim UK here. This is Space Crew. We're going straight back in where we left off. Uh, one thing I want to do, just come in here to the spacecraft. And um, now, ideally, I'd like to upgrade our weapons and stuff, but I don't think I can. What I might do is just take a look at the equipment on board and see if we can't set this up slightly better. So we've got guns and weapons everywhere. Um, that should help us out. We've got one fire extinguisher there, one at the front. We've got two of these um, escape pod things. No, they're not escape pods. What are they? Astronaut suits so that we can go out and fix the engines and stuff. But um, yeah, pretty much I think that's it. And um, just check that I've already done the crew gear here. Yeah, they're both upgraded to hardcore defensive. Let's go do a mission. So this is our first proper, proper mission. I'm going to do this one, actually. Rescue Astronomer. I've done this twice. I failed twice. It's a real 50-50 mission. It's so hard. The hardest thing is to keep the uh, Astronomer alive. Um, because we will get boarded by the enemy over and over and over again. And uh, she is pretty much the most illogical person in the world. I wish we could have her come sit up here in this section but no she'll sit here where the enemy come in all the time so uh that, that will cause some problems right let's uh bring shields down engines up to full we don't need gravity right now Got the captain to take off this really is a tough mission it, although it's right at the beginning of the game because our equipment is so bloody useless um we are quite literally in the soup before we've even started so before we even make this jump I'm going to uh, I'm going to set us up ready for a fight oh no I'm not because I've already charged so as soon as we jump I'm going to set us up ready for a fight because that's what's going to happen right. Where is our... Right, that's where we've got to go. We've got to go through the asteroids and set ourselves up there. So we've got shields on, we've got weapons on, double engines, gravity is down. sooner we get through here, the better. Ah, oh, here they come already, look. One, two, three of them. Drop the engines, bring the shields up. Use some of the uh, special abilities we've got. Get focus fire on. In fact, uh, let's uh, let's replenish shields and let's call in some fighter support as well. And uh, let's boost. Get our weapons up as well. Let's do everything we can. So they're trying to board the ship. Oh, that was close. That was literally about to board the ship there. We just got rid of him in time. Obviously we've lost the scanner because we've put uh, our scanner person on... Uh, we put the scanner person on a gun so that we can shoot at these people. The fighter support has just arrived just in time, guys. Nice timing. Uh, we really need... Uh, oh, yeah. The, uh, the reactor's damaged. The rear shield is down. Mitchell's taking a bit of a battering. And here comes the first enemies. We're going to get boarded, guys. It's happening. Attack the enemies, Mitchell. Attack the enemies. Get these guys off of our ship. I think that's the last enemy there. As soon as we take that down, we can charge. But I'm not going to rush into it because... Uh, I want to get the ship up and running 100% before I do that. Mitchell can uh, just heal yourself a little bit there, please. As, as you can see, the rear gunner takes the most amount of pounding. Okay, so we've lost... We've lost the uh, fighter support. Let's get everybody back on their stations. It would be great if you could hit a button and have everybody just go straight back to their... Uh, Default location. Okay, so we're ready to engage. I'm just going to wait. I want to make sure everybody has their stuff. 
See that focus fire is not quite charged yet. I'm just going to wait and hold off. Really, we want the boost as well. But if any enemy ships show up, I can just jump immediately, and I've got no qualms about doing that. Do not want to get into another fight in this area. Especially seen as uh, the nasty, nasty chap is often about in this area too. So we're looking good. We're still ready to hyper jump, but I want this boost. Can I tab? Yes, I can tab. Well, can I tab? I don't think tab worked in this instance. Uh, accelerate time is locked for whatever reason. I don't think there's any enemies about, but uh, so we've got boost. We have boost. Okay, right. Let's go. Ready for a for another fight. Oh, here's the outpost. Oh, flipping, flipping mouse going off onto my other screen again. Okay, so we're not going to need shields and stuff. We're just going to need full engines because this. Uh, like I say, I've done this mission a couple of times already. Uh, this space station is going to explode. It's on self-destruct. So, uh, yeah, we need to uh, be very careful of that. And I keep forgetting to put the uh, captain into defensive mode. That would uh, help our shields a lot if I could do that a bit more often. Okay, let's launch. Let's get the heck out of Dodge ASAP. The engines are on full. We cannot go any faster than we're going. So as soon as we can charge, we've got full engines, so we should charge up really quickly. Because this will uh, emit a load of um, radioactive material. So uh, we need to be really careful of that. Six seconds. And it's going to go. Charging. And there it is. That's. Do you see the yellow stuff coming out? That's radioactive. So had that have touched us, that would have uh, affected us quite, quite a bit. So we're good to get out of there. Right. Let's get the shields up. Shields on two, engines on two. Let's try and get us, us close. Enemies incoming. Oh, crikey. Here we go. Here we go. Right. In that case, let's call in fighter support. Damn it. We haven't got fighter support. We can't replenish the shields. Okay. This is not good. I should have waited. Should have waited longer before we made that first jump. So the first load of enemies are coming in. We've got them tagged. Focus fire is on. Focus fire is on. We still haven't got fighter support. We're going to have to get you into the gun. Oh, we haven't got any guns. That was silly. Oh, there's a sneaky little cheeky one. Oh, he's going to board us. He is going to board us. Oh, I didn't spot him anywhere near quick enough. Mitchell, on the gun. Montana, on the gun. Attack those enemies. That's pretty good stuff, guys. Well done. Excellent work. Still haven't got fighter support. Oh my god, they're attacking us again. Fighter support takes a long time to come in, it seems. Pretty good stuff. Actually, get on that gun. Why not? Whilst we're waiting. Fighter support. This is the third time they've attacked us. I cannot believe this. What is going on? And if these guys get through to our main systems here, they will absolutely destroy the ship. They will have the ship completely uh, taken down within seconds. 
attacked me again. I cannot believe this. Shoot that ship, Mitchell. Oh, crikey. That was uh, pretty intense. I, I've got to say, that completely took me... Uh, that took all, all my attention right away there. Whew. When it all goes, it all goes really quickly. I don't think I've ever been attacked that many times before in a row. That was, uh, that was insane. Okay, so we're ready to jump. Let's jump. And I think we're safely home. Yes, we are. That's, that's the benefit of taking the short route, is um, you do just get home after, you know, less jumps. So you have less conflicts, basically. But taking the uh, the quick route often means you get more enemy ships. So it's like swings and roundabouts as to what you do. But uh, yes, our passenger is alive, the crew are alive, the ship is mostly together. If you few bits of damage across the top hopefully we'll unlock some new equipment for the next mission and be able to uh, upgrade the guns and stuff but we'll we'll have to wait and see guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it this game's coming out uh in about two weeks time i think it's on the 15th of uh, october yeah 15th of october so uh, definitely go check it out well worth it got a few issues if you want to wait and see my review then uh, i've got an embargo against me which means i can't say I can't actually review the game. There's a few things I'd like to see changed, um, I'll be honest. But uh, yeah, overall, if you like the original, if you liked uh, Bomber Crew, then you're probably going to enjoy this almost as much, if not more. So uh, that's a pretty good indictment for any game, despite any limitations or issues that I might believe exist with it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's episode, and please join me again for another one. Take care of yourselves. Until next time, goodbye.